Many of the church members who are going to hell, it's just Milo. Milo. And I, me yari kwa asori no oma mesrami o. Oya shio se, srana oma mesrau no na e problem. And I ebi a medical bill na went to me and to ya. And you know, I see people, and they blame churches for things that are not the fault of the churches. Yes, that, that church, I pay my tithe there. I was even sick. Nobody did anything. Oh. But I thought you also pay tax to the government. And you pay NHIS. You know me so? So did the regional minister visit you? And the assemblyman? Why are you so angry with churches? And pastors? And you scream and shout and you are bitter. Listen, may you get your own money and leave the church alone. Yeah. You can clap to that one too. Listen, listen, listen. Ope kwa embo unse na me no kwe na me kachira usi se nyami e improve your financial state na e bufu be bria e wo akumano ni njina beko. Because a lot of the anger is poverty. Yes. And my business is not going well. And these prayer warriors, they have not prayed hard enough. How should they pray? Prophet Livingston is finished. I'm trying to I'm, I'm trying to see the difference between his chest and his stomach. And I don't know the difference. You are still telling him, Pastor, harder. Harder. Uh, this church, there's no anointing in the church. There's no anointing in the church. Ask them why there's no anointing in the church. It is not because they are not preaching a word that will take them to heaven. It is not because they are not preaching a doctrine that will take them to heaven. It is not because they are not preaching a doctrine that will make them holy. It is all materialistic things. My business didn't go well. And I went and they prayed and it didn't happen. And then you see, I, I went to them. I wanted a loan from the church. You want a loan from the church because this is Ghana Commercial Bank. <laughs> I went to them. I, I, I had a funeral and I went to the church for a loan. Will you believe they didn't give me? They said they didn't have money. But just the following week, I saw that in the same church, some people have bought brand new car. Why couldn't all the church members gather money and solve my problem? So that is the siege mentality with which you are sitting in the church. But may the Lord make you a king and put you in the place of authority and bless your life so that you can worship God and serve him well. Can I hear somebody clap and give God praise?